Hello everyone. My name is Takayoshi Nakashima, Managing Director of Nakashima Asia Pacific in Singapore. Now, shipping and shipbuilding industry is uh, facing a transition period. Since IMO set uh, a target to reduce emission of greenhouse gas at least 50% uh, in 2050. And on the other hand, new technology is coming, like uh, autonomous ship, uh, AI, and big data an analysis to prevent the uh, accident involving human error and reduce operation cost. Today, I'd like to introduce our initiative against uh, this new world called life cycle propulsion engineering. At first, I'd like to introduce our solution for reduction of GHG emission. We Nakashima Propeller have more than 90 year history to design and manufacture high quality propulsion system to many customers in worldwide. We believe that propulsive performance is one of the important factor to achieve uh, zero emission, whatever alternative fuel will be adapted in the future. Based on our technical expertise and experience, we have developed various type of energy saving devices over years. The combination of our high efficiency propeller and energy saving devices enable us to provide a solution for a total optimization of propulsive performance to meet each customer's requirement. The new ship design concepts such as autonomous ship and zero emission ship require a high maneuverability as well as propulsive performance. We could propose you the wide range of propulsion system as a package. IMO now consider a new regulation for underwater noise in order to protect marine life in the sea. Some action and technical consideration are required to reduce underwater noise, which generate from a propulsion system. This is our ultimate radar. The result of the model test show that and confirm that our radar actually reduced the underwater noise. We got bronze medal at Echo Action Program from Vancouver in Canada as a one of solution to reduce underwater noise as well as to increase the efficiency. As you may aware, IMO also consider uh, energy efficiency requirement for existing vessels like EEXI, Energy Efficiency Existing Ship Index. Extra care and regular maintenance are required to maintain the up performance after the delivery of the ship. We could propose you redesign proper and energy saving devices based on the analysis of actual operation profile and the performance data of existing vessels. We also could a uh, wide range of maintenance services, including uh, proper repair, and echo polishing through our service network in worldwide. Lastly, I would like to talk about our own monitoring services under development. We are now developing a new performance monitoring system with shaft force power meter and shaft thrust load meter. We also release a condition monitoring system for our propulsion system. We would provide some report and technical advice for the result of uh, the system. We could support development of hard form design for initial design stage, provide a propulsion package for new, your new building project, and propose monitoring services and the proper retrofit based on the analysis of operating 
uh, condition after the delivery. From the planning of new building project to existing vessels, during the life, uh, entire life cycle of ship, we will continue to provide innovative and high quality product and services. This is all for my presentation. I hope that you learned something new from this webinar. Thank you.